Hey guys, I'm here today with Dan Tope. Dan's kicking off his semi semi custom production line. He's kicking it off with his new model and a really nice EDC. Uh, he's named it the Bulldog. I've handled this thing a couple of times now. I handled one of the prototypes as well as the production model today. Um, it's compact, but amazingly comfortable in hand for a variety of hand sizes, guys that have really big hands to guys that have kind of average size hands like myself. Find it really comfortable. I think you'll really like this knife. Price point wise, I think it's a tremendous value. It's in 3V. And Dan's going to talk about the knife as well as the sheath. I think the sheath is a real selling point. has a variety of carry options and some really neat stuff. So I'm going to kick it over to Dan. He's going to take it from here. Cool. Thanks, Thanks Jason. Dan. All right. So as Jason said, I'm Dan Tope. Um, right now, I'm just going to show you this knife. This was going to be kind of my kickoff into the mid-tech slash semi-custom world. I, do, I build custom knives, and this is going to be my first run. And uh, as Jason said, I kind of want this to be a price point knife. Um, but I also wanted to be some awesome steel that people can afford, uh, CPM 3V. So this is the knife. This is my model that I've been using, uh, one of the first ones I built. So it's got kind of some dust and stuff like that on it. But here's the knife. It's CPM 3V. Uh, there's a ton of different handle options. And so this is kind of what it, how it feels in hand. I've got uh, medium to large size hands. Um, and then here is our sheath that we came up with. And this is actually a sheath designed by Jenna Martin from Vehement Knives. Uh, Jenna's also got a company coming out um, on her own called Skin Benders, so uh, super excited for that. Anyways, this sheath that she designed for this, this part is your vertical carry. This is what it's going to come with, okay? So this sheath is ambidextrous. You take the knife out, you flip it around, and then you can swivel the retention strap and wear it over on the left side, okay? This is the one that it comes with. This also can detach, and you can use this in your pocket or strap it to a pack or however you want to, okay? Very, very heavy duty sheath. Um, I think she did an awesome job. This is gonna be a inside the waistband carry or a conceal carry, if you will. So basically what you do is you strap this to the lower part. I got it backwards already. You strap this in here with the screws that are provided. Okay, and then you would go inside your waistband, obviously taking this top part off. Then you go inside your pants and then this comes around and I'm trying to do this with the bag on so that everybody can see, but I don't want to open this as a suit. It's going to be for a customer. Um, and then this uh, strap goes over or under your belt and then snaps back. That's how that works. And then everybody knows about scout carry straps. So here's those. They're One's a little bit bigger than the other. They come with the set in the pack, and I believe these ones come with the screws also. Um, so you can do uh, scout carry. <clears throat> as far as the vertical carry, the one that comes with it goes, it's Molly compatible. Um, so, and it also is compatible to split a belt loop, and these are also designed to fit on military and police belts. Um, so basically that's where we're at with the sheath. I just kind of wanted to explain that stuff and kind of explain where we were going with this mid-tech line. And uh, I'm super duper looking forward to these things getting up and you guys checking them out and letting me know what you think. And um, I've got a couple of other ones that we're going to be working on in the future. So um, if you have any questions, you can hit me up and... Uh, and or ask Jason. Thanks guys. The reason why we came up with the name for this as the Bulldog is because of the shape of it. It's a stout knife and because it's in CPM 3V it's very uh, resilient like a Bulldog and very stout and beefy and uh, it's tough like a Bulldog. 